all right guys what's going on welcome back to another anime defenders video as you see by the title in this video we're going to be showcasing the buffed bear king now i already went to infinite and i realized i wasn't recording but this unit is literally broken so make sure you stick around to the end to see this unit it can actually because he's literally insane but i got position on him i got him to level 66 just now and yeah we're gonna showcase him very very good units i would say for the start he's probably one of the best mythos in the game right now if not the best so we're gonna go into a i want to go into a pretty hard map we're gonna go into like blue planet and it just just says this guy but i mean yeah he's a very good unit he's fully OE. he bleeds he does everything but before i get into the showcase actually i want to say join my discord guys i do giveaways all the time and my discord is growing by the day so join up and if you guys find this helpful make sure you do subscribe but yeah let's get right into this and see how good this guy actually is bro all right, so on placement, this guy is doing 830 every five seconds. Now, I don't think they actually buffed his damage at all, uh, or not, uh, not as like not as base damage. I don't think they buffed it, but at the same time, I don't know for sure. I'm pretty sure they didn't. Pretty sure they just gave him bleed and hybrid. But I mean, that's just not, I can't just say they just gave him that. That's literally insane. But I'm gonna actually show you guys how good this guy is. So let me put let me put all them down. I see he has a four placement. Well, Mr. Guy's so good, he's a four placement, so he's so good for infinites. I wouldn't say he's as good for, like, story or anything, but for infinites, this guy's literally insane. Bro. Oh, also, they gave, they gave Boshi an ability now, but they forgot to change it. I guess it's still, uh, I guess it's still the Eager's thing, but... Yeah, there we go. I don't know if this UFO might be an air unit now. Maybe they changed that too, but as you see, bro, he bleeds, which is actually crazy. And when you place him, he's also multi-hit, so... I'm gonna get a lot of money, so we get into the final form. I know that's what a lot of you guys actually care about. So I'll be back once I have a lot of money to actually um use. Alright, boys, we actually have money now. Let's start upgrading this guy, finish all my farms, and let's go one by one. So first upgrade, 1,885 seconds. Uh nothing big, nothing special. Next upgrade is other roadly slam. I'm just gonna go through his actual ability upgrades now. This is already fully away on second ability, and it's not multi-hit, but still just pretty good. 2,685 seconds. Next uh, is Charge Storm. Now, uh, this is a small circle, or like a, it's like a decent sized circle AoE. And I'm pretty sure it's multi-hit too. Yeah, it is, so it's pretty good. Next upgrade is Other Rotary Tackle. This is a Lion AoE. There you go, pretty good. 7,000 7, damage every 6 seconds. Now, I don't usually like line AoEs, but I think it's fine for this guy since he already he always has he has full AoE abilities a lot. And honestly, this line AoE is <laughs> it's huge. So I think they should add cone AoEs to this game, bro. I don't know why they don't have cone AoEs yet because like one of the new units has a really big line AoE. It doesn't even seem like a line AoE, but enough yapping. Next next one is gonna be otherworldly force. There we go. He's already full AoE. 10k every eight seconds, and it's and it's multi hit. And look at the bleed by the way. I'm gonna sell one else so we get a better perspective on how much bleed this actually does. So let's just see. It's doing 500. Oh wait. Okay, well he just uses it, buddy. Let's wait for the next strong mob. Next, next upgrade is just a little bit more damage. Let's max him out real quick so we can see how much the bleed actually adds. But this guy's DPS is insane now that he has bleed, bro. We've been needing a bleeding unit, honestly. Sakuna's been our only bleeding for a while, and adding bleed to this guy makes him literally like. S tier, so very, very good. Look at this bleed 600, 600, 600. With that three ticks of 600, I think. I want, I need to, I'm a, I'm a, I want a boss spot so I can actually see how much it does a better representation. But let's get this last upgrade 9,000 for other roadly charged force. Now, it doesn't change anything, but just does more damage, I'm pretty sure. And it's multi hit and it's insane, bro. Last upgrade is gonna be 15,000 damage every seven seconds. I want to boss spawn in so we can see how good this guy's bleed actually is, bro. Let's just wait and see. But yeah, multi-hit, four placement, full AoE, bleeds, hybrid. This guy does it all, bro. What an insane... He's, he's, like, he's literally an insane unit, so... I really do recommend you guys get this guy. I'm glad I got him. Honestly, I wasn't going to get him until uh, the devs actually announced that he was getting buffed. Then I got him, so... Yeah, let's wait for a strong, strong unit to spawn so we can actually test. But it looks like it looks like it ticks three times for 750. Guess on this guy, 750, 750, 750. Okay, so it ticks three times for 750. So let's do the calculations real quick. 
Alright, so this bear king is doing 15,141 damage every 6.8 seconds. So he's doing 2,226 DPS every unit times 4. So it's 8,906 without the bleed. And let's see how much the bleed is doing again. I'm pretty sure it was like, what, 750 three times? Hey, I need a strong guy. Oh yeah, 758 three times. So we just do 758 times three. That's 2,274 more DPS every time on every single every single attack. So uh, I guess I guess we just add that on top of that. I guess we just add that to um the the base of 15,000 damage. Pretty sure that's how that works. Hopefully I'm not like stupid, but yeah, I guess it's just this 6.8 times four, which is, means he's doing 10 thousand damage per second and for a reference by the way this is the stat sheet on the screen now so he's already doing more than warrior princess these are all level 60s but uh this is level 66 so he's doing more or about the same as warrior princess with with, with a way bigger aoe with multi-hit with bleed so i mean he's just the best fully we missed in the game or i think he is i haven't seen a uh, muscular sorcerer or whatever his name is i haven't seen that guy yet I was seeing his like max version. That guy's really good, but yeah, I will definitely put Bear King in like top of S tier now. This guy's insane. Ten thousand DPS is pretty good with bleed. So, oh yeah, I forgot to mention the good thing about this unit and why I recommend him so much is that he's a four placement, which means you guys don't even need Almighty on him. And I I know you guys just struggle to get Almighty. It's uh very hard to get, very hard to get. But precision, which what I have is very very good on him. Requiem was good on him, so this is why I think one of the best units. Definitely a must get unit right now. Fully we bleed, and you don't even need Almighty on him for him to be good. Because Requiem, if you think about it, Requiem is literally just better than Almighty. It's straight up better than my Almighty on Bear King on a 4 plus minion. So I have enough money for them. So let's place all four of them down, bro. I think I, I, think I have enough money. I'm pretty sure it's like 63,000 to place them all down or place one down. So I, I think, yeah, I have a perfect amount. But, you know, when you put it like this, bro, this guy, 10,000 DPS just right here. All of them bleeding, so if health against regen bosses, but yeah, this unit is so good, bro. I definitely get it, guys. 100%. I'm glad I did, but yeah, that's it for this video, guys. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you do like, subscribe, and just one more time, make sure you do join my Discord. I do do giveaways, and I'm gonna be doing a giveaway for I think I'm gonna give away a shiny beast master. I'm pretty sure his name is the beast sorcerer. I don't know, I don't know if that unit's good to be honest, but I got like four of them while pulling for Gojo, so I'll give one of, one of them when he's actually tradable. I don't think he's tradable right now, but. That being said, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, make sure you do like and subscribe. It really helps me out a lot. And yeah, that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.